So this is an exciting day for Bond University, for the Faculty of Health Sciences and Medicine, and for the Institute for Evidence-Based Healthcare. Today we're launching the Institute and they're looking to the future of how we can have a sustainable healthcare system that makes best use of scarce resources and produces best value for people uh, and for society. The big achievement here is to remind everyone that at the centre of decisions about healthcare is evidence and the need for good evidence to base all our decisions on, whether we're patients, whether we're researchers, whether we're doctors, whether we're nurses, whether we're policy makers making national policy about healthcare. We need good evidence. And that's why this institute is so important because we are discovering the, the hidden harms of, of, of what's being done within healthcare. And we're trying to understand these problems of overdiagnosis and overtreatment and how to deal with them, how to address them in a fair and rational way. So it brings a number you know, of advantages to students on the Bond campus. First of all, the PhDs get an extraordinary experience here because of the atmosphere and infrastructure um, within the Institute. Um, so they get excellent training and are very um, employable afterwards. Um, for the other healthcare students, particularly the medical students, um, the Institute has been very influential in the way they get trained in a number of areas, including um, evidence-based practice and the use of non-drug therapies and um, the extent of overdiagnosis as well. These are things that the staff at the Institute work closely with the medical faculty to work on with the students. 